Oh, how you all going? So, it's been a while, but um, I'm on the east coast now of Australia, Queensland, at uh, the Maclay Island Ferry, car ferry. I'm on my way over to the island. I've got land on the island and a container, and it's actually while I was away sailing, I've got a lot of my gear stored here. So I'm gonna catch up with a friend here and um, go over and check a few things out, put a few things away. Uh, I've got a bit of time off work, uh, about a couple of weeks off, so which is pretty good. Um, yeah, so I'd like to show you Maclay Island. Uh, it's in Moreton Bay in uh, Queensland. And um, yeah, I'll get to show you a little bit of it as we go along. And the other thing I forgot to mention, um, unfortunately, I've lost all my cameras and my film gear, um, which I'm gonna replace, I was gonna replace that anyway. So all these blogs are gonna be done with my nifty iPhone. So I hope it all turns out. And um, yeah, we'll just see how we go with that. <laughs> It'll have to do for now. Ferry's just pulled in and um, we'll get ready to board and then start heading over the island. Lighting and my car's come down there. We'll put that together with uh, pins. On the island, um, it's been a while since I've been baggy. I've had a bit of things done, a few things done, and uh, yeah, so I'll show you. This is where eventually I'll most probably come to retirement and get old. That's after I sail this boat back to Australia. Hobo's coming back here, and uh, Kamora here, and Walton Bay as well, which would be pretty good. 
good. But um, I'm going to have a look at this. So, I've arrived at my destination, where I'm staying for the next couple of days, where I come over and sort out a few things on my property. But this is a lovely little place. It's an Airbnb on the Clay Island, and it's absolutely beautiful. So I'm gonna give you a little look around. And here we are. What a nice little place. It's an Airbnb on the Clay Island. Um, Cotton Road. Right down near the water. Excuse my rubbish, and obviously I brought my rubbish here. I must leave this place exactly how I found it. It is absolutely beautiful, it's great. So here we go, we're going for a little walk down the end of this um, little jetty that the people have got on this property. And um, we'll have a little look. What's at the other end? It's a jetty for the mangroves. And while I'm filming it, I better keep my eye on everything, otherwise I'll end up in there. It's crazy. This is really, really beautiful. And I'll just do a slow turnaround. And that's where I'm staying up there. I'm staying in a little Airbnb just underneath the main house. That's beautiful. We've got the cockatoos going crazy. And I need to concentrate. There's some nice mud crabs in here somewhere. That would be for sure. Anyway, let's move on. Oop, so the gaps get a bit bigger. Jeez. We're nearly at the end. So here we are at the end of the jetty. Mud crab city actually. Australian East Coast mangroves. Mokai Island, beautiful place. So that's really good. I've already messed up. I've walked down here and filmed this. I've walked down. And of course, uh, Ian doesn't know how to use the phone. And I've had it on slow motion. So anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, yeah. I'd say McClay Island, a lovely block of land these people have here. And it's a great boom, but it's only a small place, but a great place for two people, for a couple, you know. Like, it is, it'd be awesome here for a weekend. But I'm on my own here um, at the moment because I'm just here to do some work. So uh, anyway, beautiful. That's the track. Great spot, come and chill out and take it easy. Remiss from the past, I guess, maybe. Um, yeah, we're, like I say, we're in Morton Bay. Morton Bay here is, is actually where I learned to sail, it's my sailing grounds, and 
there's lots of little islands and things like that here. And it's really cool to be back here. I'm really enjoying it. But I want my boat. <laughs> I need to get back to Turkey. I gotta get this boat back to Australia. Yeah, the adventure will happen. I think COVID's been hitting in the bum. But, um, you know, in saying that, there's a lot of things else going on. There's wars going on now, and, you know, it's making it, everything's starting to get really difficult, you know, the whole world, not only you, it's not all about you, but, you know, I, it's, I'm going to battle through, I want to do what I want to do, and it'll happen. It'll happen. Excuse me. <laughs> it's gonna happen. But um time I guess time will tell. Bit of hard work. Need to get some dollars together. Cost everyone a nuts like mega bucks. Everyone knows that. Um and the poor people have lost businesses and you know, the effect it had on on, on everybody. But um Anyway, I'll do it on two bob, man. <laughs> Just get that bait ready and get it back in the water. We're off. Yeah, I'm down here and it's coming to the end of the day. But um, I'll try and get down here in the morning and see. Give you another aspect of it. But I mean, it doesn't look like beautiful, but it is beautiful because it's all swamp now. It's Australian swamp. And it's good. And I love it. And I love my country. And I love everybody. And thanks for everyone for watching. And you know, um, a lot of people have been on a big ride with me. Um, brought me through a lot of things in, in the recent past as well. Um, I'm not going to go into it. <laughs> I don't need to. Um, but I'm not nuts, just had a bit of a trauma, but uh, yeah, all good, all good. There's actually an escaped convict, it's an Irish fella, he used to live on his island. He's going back quite a few years ago. Um, I'll tell you more about him and I'll show you where he used to live and where he's died out. And the um, thing was, he spent 14 years here hiding away and doing all these things he did and he'd been pardoned and given um, right of passage. But anyway, I'll let you know more about him later. Cheers. So anyway, the sun's going down and uh, I'm making my way back. Let's turn the camera that way. And this is on the iPhone. I'm making my way back down to there. I've come from there and I was been up there we're missing <laughs> as we all do just we're missing about life what's gone wrong in life what's gone good in life what's happening in life and what's going on with the world um, yeah You know how it comes. It's the only way you can do it.